Okay guys, um, I've got a machine out for the day, got a couple things to do to sort out this road uh, with all the water is running off, show you guys from over there on that side, from the neighbor's land and it runs down damaging the whole road. So even if it's not my road, it belongs to uh, the municipality. Um, I still have to pay uh, out of my own for fixing up the road so um, this trench we're digging here or he's actually digging for us here let me show you guys over here that is all for the water to run off so what he did over here so far here on my, on my behind me here is he dig the trench and put the excess soil excess soil here on the back and then you'll level the nice out later when I'll show you guys how it looks like afterwards and then in the front of me you'll dig another little trench across the road on two places where you can cross the road there and further up to the top so the water comes from the neighbor's side from the neighbor's side the water and then it'll run into there and then it will access down, down here this trench here and then run off back to the river again so um, yeah waiting for a very long time to get the assistance um, they can nearly two years for that but anyway we're there not complaining I'm just grateful that we can sort the right out and that's all you need to count your blessings so yeah let me show you guys behind me again uh, looks further down the road yep okay show you guys a bit later it looks Digging for the French train for the septic tank.
Okay guys, um, the finish of the road here, all the water comes from that side always, comes down here, run through here. Next time we will, we will put a pipe next time here and put um, stone and header over here and make like a speed pump, if I can call it, and stone on that side so the water can run nicely off. Um, then we will run down here, we will put some rocks in here when we got time. Well, that's it. I'm happy. It looks now drivable again. Um, yeah, can't complain. Here we go. Have a smooth drive again, first time in months. And um, gonna enjoy it. I also made him make the road much wider to the end so you can push most of the soil also down and so it can be compact because now you're digging it. A trench a little bit away from here and you're taking space from access of the road again you got trees trees on that side as well so you need that space there you need the extra space on this side otherwise you have a narrow road and the road was actually ending about an, a meter and a half away so I made him in a certain spot was very narrow I made him go a bit over operator so you can dig a bit more wide in so and the soil on this side is also much solid so yeah we had a long dig trench over here very deep here and the water was running down there so that's a bit soft so hope this water will come nicely down from here and run down here where it means to go and rejoin a little stream on the bottom where I'll show you guys now this part here was very rough very 4x4 four four drive area again so a big spitter and here the water will go through here and join a little stream over there again all along up to the top I'll show you guys a bit further down and also more drivable here and here I also made him it's just water if it pours there, we'll go down this stream here again. And then here I also made it a little go a bit wider because the road was a little bit very uneven at a little island in the middle of the track so your, your bucket keeps on hitting the bottom because over here like you see all the rocks there that's where the rain is coming down and running that's their powerful of the rain so it was very difficult to drive so I made him take the little speed bump out in the middle come across you know time is limited and they ask for the money here comes the other guy I took all the rubble from the house most of it and I leveled up this area again so now a bit of drive as well, I don't know how long that will last until I'll build my little bridge up here and then we'll make a nice from here to the concrete. Okay guys, I'm going to show you, and not so much straight, like a 40 year dig, but anyway, it's there. So there's a French drain here, this long distance, 20 meters. Show you guys how it look. And yeah, this all the water came up underneath the ground. So refilling up here. So yeah, safety tank gonna be a bit of a challenge to put that in. in. But anyway, a little swell.
The path comes here. So it goes all along that way. And over there where the two piles of heaps of sand is. Septic tank goes there and then it goes on further on for the French drain. And then we were coming from this side all along the dam. We go up. The pub will continue from here to there because of the inspection eye. But the actual pub is here for the toilet. From here to here it will come out. And then also we clean up a stone over here, there's some more stone here. Couldn't, couldn't manage to move all this for me and clear up as I wanted it in my mind but you know what it's no train smash we'll deal with it later spade and wheelbarrow can make this place in the front look very nice that's it mm -hmm.